I'm trying to watch less porn lately. Um, I don't know, anyone else trying to cut down? No, okay. Absolute perverts, all of you. Uh, hello, you sound very, very excited. Uh, I'm Crystal Evans, very good to be here. Uh, I'll let everybody know up top uh, where I'm from. I'm from the West Coast of the US. Uh, now, a lot of people over here hear that and they think of like California and the Beach Boys and sunshine and marijuana, right? But uh, I'm from Washington State. Uh, so think more like Nirvana and rain and heroin, right? Uh, and I live in Scotland now, so that really feels like home to me. It's really good. Um, I travel a bit for comedy, right? I travel a bit. Um, I was in Iceland recently, uh, and I was supporting an Icelandic comedian. Um, and right before I went on stage, she said to me, uh, Crystal, just to let you know, Icelandic people hate Americans. <laughs> And I was like, oh, well, um, just so you know, that doesn't make you special, okay? <laughs> yeah, get down off your high horse, Iceland, okay? Or get down off your tiny little horse, I guess. Uh, <laughs> No, it's, <laughs> I love living here in the UK. I live over here um, and I really love it. But it's weird for me being from the only country that British people can punch up to. You know what I mean? Like, you know what I mean? Like, see like right wing British people feel comfortable complaining to me about immigrants, right? And then when I remind them that like, I'm an immigrant. They're like, yeah, you know what we mean, <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. It happens to me too, though, right? Like, I, w I was discriminated against at work the other day, right? My boss was like, Crystal, you can't wear that backless dress. And I was like, why? What, because I'm a woman and my body's inherently sexual? And he was like, no, because you have a full back tattoo of a bald eagle with his dick out, right? <laughs> I know, punished for being a patriot, unbelievable. Absolutely <laughs> shocking. Uh, speaking of dicks out, um, I'm, uh, I'm trying to watch less porn lately. Um, I know, anyone else trying to cut down? No, okay. Absolute perverts, all of you. Uh, I know what you mean, it's a very difficult thing to stop. Like for me, uh, it kind of feels like I'm in the middle of the ocean and someone's taken away my jet ski and now I've got to like, wank myself five miles to shore, you know? <laughs> Difficult, you know? And like, hey, I'm a busy person, you know what I mean? Like, I'm very busy, like, I've got two kids, uh, I've got a job as well, and I do this, and like, at the end of the day, I just don't have the time to like, go out and find horses that are willing to have sex in front of me, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> yeah. Why do you think I went to Iceland, you know? It's sexy little magical ponies. Um, no, I'm busy is the point. I'm very busy in my life. Um, I do have two kids, for real, uh, uh, and I had them over here, you know, so they're my anchor babies, so you can't kick me out. Uh, <laughs> and I had them in Scotland, uh, and uh, my husband is Scottish as well, so I'm the only American in my household, which means I'm the only one who can use the Alexa. So, um, <laughs> so for me. Uh, you know, uh, uh, they're, they're having a, an upbringing that's quite different than my own, you know what I mean? My, uh, my parents were divorced when I was growing up, um, and they got divorced when I was one, so I don't really remember it, because uh, I was on mushrooms. And, um, <laughs> and yeah, I lived with my mom after the divorce, right? Uh, which was weird, because dad was actually the more stable adult, right? Like, he sometimes drove drunk, but he was like really good at it, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know? Uh, and as for mom, uh, mental illness runs in her side of the family. Yeah, so does being hilarious. Uh, and they tend to go hand in hand, right? So like, I might be in trouble. <laughs> Some of you are like, nope, you're fine. Uh, yeah, mom apparently always struggled with that, like from childhood, right? But like it was the 70s, so no one knew what that was yet. They were just like, oh, you know her, she's a free spirit, <laughs> okay? <laughs> Or as the doctors later described it, bipolar, okay? <laughs> yeah, you literally can't leave. You have to watch the rest of my set. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Uh, when I was 14, right, uh, uh, my house burned down, okay? Spoiler, I made it out alive, okay? Don't worry. Uh, but I did uh, get injured from it, right? I got burned, and I had very intense smoke inhalation. Uh, some of it from the house fire. <laughs> hey -o. Okay. <laughs> 
Yeah, so not a typical upbringing, do you know what I mean? But you never think how you're growing up is abnormal while you're in it, though, right? Like, I remember growing up in high school, um, uh, you know, uh, people who had uh, normal parents would tend to complain about them quite a lot, which I found interesting, right? Like, I remember I said to a friend in high school, like, pfft. My mom's crazy. <laughs> She'd be like, oh my God, I know what you mean. Like yesterday, when I wasn't home, my mom went into my room and cleaned it. <laughs> and I'd be like, yeah, exactly. Like when I was seven, my mom used to make me hold the wheel while she lit her cigarettes, right? And like, <laughs> she wouldn't even pass me one. Talk about mind games, you know what I mean? <laughs> But I'll leave you with this. Uh, you guys have been lovely. I, I get this a lot in my personal life. You know, when people find out I do stand-up comedy, they'll say to me, wow, Crystal, you do stand-up? God, that is so brave. You know, I could never do that. And I'm like, you think I'm brave? There's people who do this that suck, you know? <laughs> like, they're the real heroes. Okay, thank you very much. I'm Crystal Evans. Enjoy the rest of your night.